Is Kim planning another nuclear test? Images show North Korea could strike without warning. Grainy images of the Nampo naval shipyard on the Hermit Kingdom's west coast show Kim is continuing to work on his second barge so his navy can carry out underwater test missile launches. The 68 feet barge is identical to another seen at the Sinpo South shipyard on the east coast which has been involved in up to six test launches since 2014. According to 38 North, which monitors, it could suggest the Hermit State is expanding the submarine-launched ballistic missile and development program to the west coast. Experts believe the aerial images of the Pungaira nuclear test facility also show a central ring that is used to support a missile launch tube during testing. In further signs work is continuing on the second barge, images show it in the same location but the portal crane on the east side is now rotated over. Joseph S. Bermudez Jr. said, imagery from September 21 shows the test stand barge in the same location but the portal crane on the east side is now rotated over, and work is being done on the barge. However, the nature of this work cannot be determined from the imagery. Clearly visible in all images is the central ring that is used to support a missile launch tube during testing. During a test, support cables are connected from the center and top of the launch tube to the four support towers. If the barge is being modified, rather than being scrapped, the diameter and height of the central ring may provide an indication of the size and class of missile that will be used to support during testing. The latest development comes as the world teeters on the edge of World War III amid tensions between North Korea and the US. North Korea and the US continued saber-rattling intensified after Kim's September 3rd test of a hydrogen bomb showed its capabilities were advancing significantly and faster than many had expected. Satellite images taken on September 8, five days after the bomb went off, appeared to show large cargo trucks and mining carts in the South Portal area. On the other side of the site where the hydrogen bomb was detonated on September 3rd in this most powerful nuclear test to date. The pictures showed what appears to be a fresh crater, potentially caused by the portal used for the hydrogen bomb test giving an after detonation, although 38 North said it was impossible to be certain. But analysts concluded the latest nuclear test yielded an estimated 250 kilotons blast, or one quarter megaton, which is believed to be the maximum yield the Pangara can contain.